Hello lamp fans, this week we're looking at the Queen from Aladdin. Uh, these lamps were built from 1937 to 1939. Um, and it's a two piece construction. So they have like a metal base, of course the glass font kind of glued to the top. Um, so I have here uh, the basically from B95, 97 and 98. Um, some of them are supposed to have a bronze finish base and some of them are supposed to have a silver finish base. So these have some alternate colors that have been changed over the years for good reason. Um, so uh, the pink one, for example, I picked up not so long ago, that was replated uh, in um, brass and it looks quite nice, but the original finish probably would have been a silver plate. Uh, which is fine. Um, I don't think any of the real silver plate ones really exist much anymore. Uh, the coating was really thin and came off. And some of them had bronze, a bronze finish as well too. So they had a white moonstone with a bronze oxidized finish. So I'm pretty sure that the one we see here, um, second from the left, uh, is the bronze finish. And it's, uh, it's, it's uh, kind of still there. The one on the left is the alternate mold and... It's a different height lamp. So they have a different uh, a different glass font and it's slightly taller. Now that one was extremely corroded. It was white and it was horrible looking and it was just a, it was just not a very pretty lamp. And so what I did is I just quickly cleaned off the corrosion with just the wire brush and then just applied some gold uh, leaf from um, and put that on to give it a more of a, a nice shelf appeal. I, I mean, I could pull it all off, but it would look really, really bad. But let's get a little closer to the uh, fonts here. So you can see this is the typical scallop font that you're going to find on most of them. So this, that's the more common one. But then on this one here, we have a revised mold. Now, I'm not sure what happened if this mold ended up breaking near the end of production or, or getting a problem and then they just, you know, made it bigger. Uh, this lamp is physically bigger. So if we go back and we hold them, you can go back, you can see that the alternate lamp, the one with the non-scallops is approximately, well, that's about three eighths of an inch taller. Uh, but anyway, so that's what that looks like. Uh, the, you see the scalloping, hard to focus in on it scalloping is there I'm sorry and this is just eccentric circles so they've made an extra eccentric circle up top to make it taller uh, and they got rid of the scalloping so this one is uh, definitely a keeper uh, as I said I had to fix it it was like looking at it was horrible it had white spots and so I just thought I'd make it look a little better but uh, anyway so that's kind of what they look like this one here has a little bit of a nickel finish left. The rest of them have been polished out. Um, so anyway, uh, hope you like this week's little short video. Not much to be said about this lamp. It's I think it's one of the more prettier lamps uh, that they've made uh, just because it's a two piece construction and uh, they look real nice uh, on the wall. Well, uh, thanks for uh, watching and have yourselves a great day.